You know, Dispel Dice must be watching because there's no way they fit a candle in this guy. Or a chonk for that matter. You know, there wasn't even bubble wrap inside. Am I on some sort of naughty list? I've got to hand it to them. The designs on their last two Gen Con bags have just been outstanding. I mean, this guy is cool on its own. Look at that wicked dragon coming at you with the fire. But the fact that they're able to tie this into that 50th anniversary of D&D, outstanding. So let's dive in. Let's see what we got. So there's a few guaranteed items in this guy. So let's see if we can pull those out here. All right. Fishing, fishing. All right, here we go. <laughs> so this is the lanyard and pass case. You can see they feature that dragon design again. I will say the uh, pass case itself, in person, this design's a little dark. It would have been nice to have that a little bit brighter on the printing. But it looks like a solid case, and uh, I think work very well for uh, if you're using this in any sort of convention or workplace with your ID. All right, moving on. And there we go. This is the uh, special pin that's in this set. Actually a really cool Dispel Dice icon pin there with the flames. A little, it almost looks like a claw from the dragon come out, or maybe those are just more flames, I don't know, but it looks cool. Adding that to the collection. Okay, now this one guaranteed two dice sets, so let's see what we got. You know, and there's third item worth $70 or more, so we'll see. All right, first up, Golden Country, ooh, okay. Intriguing, I like that that's in the uh, dragon set. That seems appropriate. <laughs> Whoa, okay, look at that. Wow, ooh, these are really cool. Wow, really intricate patterns here. Wow, okay, I'm gonna have to get these guys out and uh, roll them, but the vibes I'm getting, like these are really intricate and cool looking. I'm really digging this set. This is really neat. The gold on the gold, it works. It's, it's a more muted gold for the inking there, but that, that background jumps out at you. But it does provide enough contrast to actually you know see what your numbers are. And these are the kind of dice, if you kind of like to just kind of stare off into your dice for a while, these have these designs that they work for that. I mean, look at those guys. That is intricate stuff. You can just kind of sit there twirling these guys while you're waiting, you know, for your turn or whatever. Uh, hopefully you're still paying attention, but, <laughs> you know, this gives you something to stare at and kind of think about. Maybe a good uh, meditation exercise there while you're looking at these. Yeah, this set is really cool. Wow, digging that one. Yeah. Golden Country Iconic Set. Very neat. Very appropriate to go with the dragons here. Wow, yeah. I am digging this. I gotta I gotta take a look at these. I gotta, you know. This is a cool set. We're off to a great start here. We're definitely looting the dragon's horde here. <laughs> Alright, let's set these bad boys aside. Let's keep digging in here. <laughs> Alright, next, another set. Dog Bakery. Hello. This seems like one of their more recent sets, too. Dang, look at those. Okay. Wow, that's a, that's an interesting. Very, what am I looking at here? <laughs> it's kind of... Wow, they're okay. There we go. We've got little designs of dogs on there. Kind of the mixed up colors, almost like, um, getting really vibes of like a, like some sort of fancy coffee there in the background, <laughs> but they got the little pictures in there, too. Very interesting, very cool. Yeah, hard to see some of that, but I like the numbering. It does stand out nicely against that kind of like brownish, darker background. Very interesting sets here. What do you guys think about this one? This one, I'm, I'm kind of, I don't know where I stand on this guy yet. It's, it's very interesting, but you know, I don't know if the color combination works for me. What do you guys think? There we go. <laughs> These are a little. I gotta look at it a little more. These are pictures of food in there. That's what the little piece of toast and stuff. It was a little hardier initially when I'm looking at this guy, like, what am I looking at exactly? But yeah, the little food items in there. There you go. So we're on to that third item that you're guaranteed in here, which is something valued at $7 or more. Obviously not a candle or a chunk here. It's a dice set of some sort. So let's see what we got. Okay, I've never seen anything wrapped in plastic before. Petal Storm. Okay. Check you out. Let's see what this guy looks like. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Very cool. Wow. That's an inclusion set. Wow. Okay, look at those petals in there. Silver inking on there. Very cool. Interesting. I like, like the swirl inside there with kind of a little bit of glitter sparkling about, a little bit of foil. Very interesting. What kind of flowers are those? You guys know what that is? I'm, I'm kind of at a loss here taking a look. Very cool though. Very interesting set. Very interesting sets in this guy, you know, I gotta say, 
happy with getting three sets of dice, like in these, you know, these mystery sets here, the lucky bags, like they've got this new lower price, but oops. Sometimes those guaranteed items you get is, um, it could be a little funky if you saw my last video, but three dice sets, super happy for, uh, you know, 120 bucks. That, that's a great deal on their dispel dice. That's basically half price on these guys. Haven't seen any obvious issues with these guys. All these sets are very interesting. Love this one. The um, Golden Country, definitely the favorite so far. That one is very cool, very interesting. Like, from a distance, it almost kind of looked like... Um, circuit boards to me but as you look at it it's, it's very interesting patterns just very cool i don't even know how i describe kind of the art style on them but there's something about them that just makes you kind of stop and you're like hey i gotta look at that a little more and then we got the dog bakery which is it's like a cute little set you know there's like little food pictures all around it on there like and then you got this guy the pedal storm with that inclusion in there that flower kind of effect man i really want to pull these to the side Gonna take a look at these a little more in person but yeah wow three great sets super happy with this didn't score a chunk but you know that's that's what most of these are going to be so I, i'm not surprised by that but yeah super awesome super happy and again like i said this design on this bag this is killer like this was almost this was a major reason why i bought this one because i really wanted that it, it ties in perfectly to that 50th anniversary of D D. It looks cool on its own, even if that wasn't occurring. So yeah, the Gen Con Lucky Vegs. I wish I'd gotten that gelatinous ooze one they had last year. That one looked awesome too. And similarly, probably would have been pretty sweet to open up, but I got this one, super happy with it. And if you like this one, check out some of the other videos I've got on the Dispel Lucky Vegs. All right, thanks for watching. Remember to keep rolling. Bye.